South Carolina's missed its last six until the layup from Fawaili. I would go to Del Rosario. I would let her check Walker. And they do. Del Rosario will shoot free throws again. My ladies at full Wiley kicks it in right at the free throw line area and explodes past Haley Van Lift for the finish. Camilla Cardoso loves it. Full Wiley and Pow Pow tied for the team lead for the Gamecocks with seven points apiece. Bree Hall in to replace Tessa Johnson. This is the first. Well, the SEC men's basketball tournament early round games will be over on the SEC network and the ESPN app. They'll have both first round games Wednesday, the second round games on Thursday, and of course the quarterfinals take place on Friday from Nashville. Short on both. to the free throw line for LSU thanks to Anissa Morrow. I mean this as a compliment, but she is a beast inside. Anissa Morrow is carrying the mail with Angel Reese being on the bench. The physicality she can bring. And look at that black eye, that shiner. She ain't shying away from contact. Uh, Brooke, remember watching her at DePaul? I mean, this is a player that was the alpha on her team. She was the go-to in her two seasons and an All-American. Right, and, and sometimes undersized as well. I mean, I'd like to say a lot of matchups she goes up against, but that never enters her mind. She's got to be one of the strongest undersized post players that is in the game. Carolyn, I mean, have you seen another player in the past that kind of compares to her style? You had LaCole Willingham that played at Auburn that was undersized and physical like Anissa Morrow. Anissa Morrow, an All-American at DePaul. And she came to LSU, wanted to play on a bigger stage, and there's not one much bigger than playing in the SEC and playing alongside Angel Reese. Well, Kim Mulkey has called her unselfish to do that. Travel on Haley Van Lith. Mulkey wasn't happy about that one. That was a missed opportunity. LSU is plus five in the re plus eleven in the rebound category, and that's with Angel Reese on the bench. They were looking to go high low. Three Hall will reset. Pow Pow. They try again. Ten seconds for the Gamecocks. For Wiley. Money! That's what I was looking for. Paul Wiley can make it happen. Ten points for Malaysia for Wiley. LSU looking for the last shot of the half. I'd give the ball to Anissa Morrow. Let her go to work. She's on the block battling with Fagan. Van Lith pulls up. Knocks it down. Just a four-point game at the half. The top two teams in the SEC meeting for the second time. It's been everything and more we thought it would be.